Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have my last unboxing of the month, my Macy's Beauty Box. Before we go into this, just remember my channel really is about, um, of course, having so much fun with makeup and beauty and skincare and all of those things, but also saving money while doing it. So I always like to reflect on these boxes ever after I get them to see if they're really a good value for me. So we might be doing a little reflecting at the end of this video on this one. So um, this is the Macy's Beauty Box. It is a $15 box a month and it doesn't have like a guarantee, like you're gonna get a guaranteed amount. You do get five deluxe size items and then there's usually a bonus item in there. And it comes in a little bag. This month's bag says be your own, be your own beautiful. And it comes with a little card. You get $5 off your next um, beauty purchase from Macy's. And then it says it has a little thing of what everything is in there. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. The first thing that we got is a skin purifying. And I want to say everyone gets the exact same thing in these boxes as well. Um, so the skin purifying, I'm green tea sheet mask from Tony Moly. You guys know I love a sheet mask and a Korean brand. <laughs> so of course I'm going to use this. The value of this is $3.00 and uh, green tea is great for your skin. Um, I do buy Korean products from Korea, so I would get this for about 50 cents. Um, so one thing to think about. And next we have, most people wouldn't though, so we'll call it $3. The Origins Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream brighten and deep puff. This is a 0.17 ounce and the full size is 0.5 ounces and it's $31. So this is about a $10 value. Um, I do like this eye cream. I've used it before um, just in samples that I've gotten. This seems to be a popular sample that Origins gives out. Um, and ginseng is really great for your skin. So that were the $10 value. Then we got a Schmitz Rose and Vanilla Natural Deodorant. Um, I have actually heard some people talk about this and I've wanted to try it. So the full size is 3.25 ounces and it's $9. This is 0.7 ounces, so it is about a $2 value. And then we've got the Coors Wild Rose Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial. So this is like a sleeping mask. It's going to be a thicker, meh, uh, a thicker kind of moisturizer. So it's a sleeping mask. Um, it's got hyaluronic acid. It's for softer, smoother, more radiant skin. Full size is 1.35 ounces. This is 0.68 ounces. So the original size is $48, so this is about a $24 value. Um, like if I think realistically about it, would I go out and spend $24 on a, a 0.68 ounce moisturizer? No, I've got some great Korean moisturizers that are 10 to $15 for several ounces. Um, so like realistically, I would call 0.68 ounces worth a couple dollars, maybe maybe ten dollars, maybe not twenty four for sure. Um, so I just that's kind of like how I try to think about it. Like, would I go out and spend this much on a moisturizer, whether it's Coors or some other brand? Because um, I try to find the best quality products for the cheapest amount. Then we've got a Kula Mineral Sunscreen SPF thirty unscented, which is great, a matte tint. I think I've used this and really like it actually. Um, so this is uh, 1.7 ounces of $36 value. This is 0.17 ounce, so it's $3.60 value. And then we got an extra little bonus, um, a Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue. I do like this sample. I have wanted, been wanting to try the Complexion Rescue from Bare Minerals, but you know, you can't just go in and try it. So you get four different um, shades in here, which I think is really great that they're giving you different shades. So lots of people that get the box would be able to try it out because this is not 
a subscription box that you fill out a survey or they try to tailor to your skin tone or hair color or things like that. So I think it's great that they sent something that everyone could still try the product in. Um, so that is the Macy's Beauty Box. That went really fast because there wasn't really try on stuff in this one. I paid $15 for that and it was a total value of $42.60. Um, overall, I would say this is my least favorite box of the ones I get between BoxyCharm, Sephora, and Macy's. There were not bad products in it. It is not a bad deal by any means. I don't want you to think that I am saying that. Um, but I do, like when I try to think about it, is it worth my money? Um, those are just some of the thought processes that I go through. So I don't know how long I'll keep this one. I'll probably get another box or two just to kind of see how the products are. But we're just getting a lot of skincare. And if you've seen any of my skincare videos, um, skincare is very like high priority for me. And I guess I have my things that I love with skincare picked out. So maybe that's kind of why I'm biased about it. Um, but if you're thinking about trying it, um, you know, just kind of think, I feel like we do get more kind of skincare items in there, which is not bad if you want to try those things out. I love that we got this deodorant. That might seem silly, but um, I've been wanting to try out Schmidt's deodorant. Um, I've used this before and it is a great eye cream. Excited to try out this and you know, I'm going to be using this sheet mask. <laughs> So I'll put the link down below if you do want to join the Macy's subscription box. For me, it's going to be something that I kind of keep an eye on whether it is something that's a value to me or not because I don't just want to spend $15 if it's not really a value to me. Let me know if you've used any of those products and love them. Um, let me know if you've used this one and like it because to me, I've used it before and it's just been kind of an all right item to me. Definitely not worth $48. Thank you for joining me. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.